scientific uh, materialism is the, a philosophy related to the modern science. Uh, and it appeared uh, not long after the birth of modern science. And at first it was based uh, on a number of postulates or assumptions about the nature of reality, universe. So these assumptions are philosophical. One of them is materialism. So it's the idea that everything in the universe can be reduced to uh, material particles and fields. And another uh, assumption is reductionism, which is the idea that complex system, like the brain, for instance, can be reduced to uh, the uh, operation of smaller components within the brain, uh, and ultimately to material particles and, and fields. Scientific materialism is not at all uh, a necessary condition for good science, uh, because after a few centuries, uh, it became uh, an ideology, a belief system, and science is uh, essentially uh, an open-minded, uh, non-dogmatic method of exploration of nature. So it shouldn't be um, related or guided by any assumptions, any beliefs, any ideology, like uh, materialism, for instance. So we, we need to go beyond materialism. Matter exists, it's, it's been shown in physics, and we have to recognize it. But materialism cannot allow us to be able to account for a number of phenomena, including mind, consciousness, uh, spiritual experiences, and so on and so forth. So we need to go beyond the materialist framework. We need uh, what I call a post-materialist uh, framework or paradigm um, that is more open-minded, which includes uh, uh, or is more sympathetic to uh, all sorts of uh, phenomena, empirical phenomena, including uh, mediumship uh, research, including reincarnation research, uh, research about near-death experience, and so on and so forth. Uh, all those uh, empirical evidence that are completely uh, uh, rejected by the strict materialist uh, scientists.